Hey, it's uh, Dave from Ghetto Van Adventures. I'm going to show you a little neat trick I found when I was doing a few experiments. Everybody wants to go on a trip. Uh, best way to make money is to save money, I think. So I've got the old wood stove going. It's about minus 30 outside. Uh, top of the wood stove is, say, oh, 544 degrees. Now, right there, we have a replacement fire brick, which is 81 degrees. Okay, so. What I have found, if you take this fire brick and put it on a wood stove, now be careful, of course your wood stove is hot, so you don't want to burn yourself. Everybody should know their wood stove is hot when there's a fire going, but we're just saying it for the people who don't know. Anyway, put the fire brick on top, I'll leave it for about an hour, and I'll come back and I'll show you something kind of neat I found and what I use it for. Okay, we're back. The top of the stove is a blistering over 600 degrees. Right there, it's 481. The fire brick, 388 degrees. That's friggin' hot. Okay, I'm gonna put it in a hot water bottle bag. I bought this off uh, the internet. You can get them, they're cheap. Uh, they come with a little drawstring. And I'm going to pick up that fire brick right there with an oven glove so I don't burn my hands. Use some common sense. Don't grab the stupid fire brick that's 300 degrees with your bare hands. Anyway, I'm gonna take that fire brick, I'm gonna stick it in the bag. There, fire brick is in the bag and it's friggin' hot. Uh, I'll just tie that off and I take it to bed with me. I can sit on the chair, watch some TV, put it under a blanket if I want, whatever, keeps me warm saving money i can drop down the temperature in my house if i want this thing will last all night long but it is freaking hot i can feel the heat through there so just be careful too like it's hot anyway hope it keeps you warm it's minus 30 out here i need it and for those of you who don't have a wood stove i have this in the oven here's the block here taking it out i just cooked some food so, now this is hot. Remember, hot. Wrapping it up in a nice towel. Oh, that is so warm. There's another way you can do it. And if you wrap it up, you're not gonna get burnt or anything else. There you go. There, it's all set.